All right, we are now in officially my favorite part of Brighton Town, the lanes. That is Oriental Art. It sells like, well, you can imagine, like ornaments from like China and Japan and stuff like that. It's quite cool, but it has that, um, that smell, that funny smell, like incense or something that you often get in uh, places like that. Like, I don't really like it. It's hard to explain that kind of sweet, musky smell. I think it definitely is incense. Another one of those little cafes. Vegetarian shoes, the butt of many jokes. You meet a vegetarian, you say, you know, if you want something to eat, there's vegetarian shoes over there. Comedia, that's a performance place. Small act and big act perform there. Cyber candy, that's cool. That's an import sweet shop. As you can see, kind of cool. Most of it's American, so probably nothing from a lot of people watching to care about. Lost the sex shop, as you well imagine. Hello, pretty. Oh, okay, that's not too romantic. Are you looking at me? Hey? Yeah, that's just an ordinary glasses store. Oh, I'm sexy, yes I am. Yeah, that's a cafe, I think. <laughs> kick a moo cow. Why kick a moo cow? Because they're gay. Um, yeah. I don't know if that's the vegan one. I think that's a vegan one, yeah, that's vegan food. To be born again. That one's got to be a second hand style. It's funny what you don't notice until you start taking pictures or filming things. White Rabbit, another cafe. Right, books. There's actually quite a few book bookstores around, second-hand bookstores. Brighton style is pretty much whatever you want it to be. Compare that to that. Sale, sale. I'm getting hungry now, which is great because I love eating out. Unfortunately, I don't think anything's open for ages. You should really do this. You should really come out at 7, 6 o'clock. Or earlier than that, if it gets lighter earlier, and if shops open earlier, and if you live in a busier area, you should just come have a walk around and look at where you live, because sometimes you miss things. When you live somewhere, you miss the really nice things. You miss all the stuff that is actually really cool, and that you value, and that you like about a place. And when you live there, and you work there, and you go to school there for a long time, it's so easy to just take everything for granted, like, I never come into town. And when I do, I really like it. Like, there's some unbelievable places that I go to. And I wish I could appreciate it all the time. Bonsai Co is great. It's, uh, well, it's just bonsais, which is a type of plant common in Japanese botanical gardens, which is, I just think it's awesome. There's always the dog walkers. Yeah, I just, um, so, yeah, the plants are really nice in themselves and everything. But so cool. <laughs> That's the way we do it here. My, that is my favorite food shop. You can get this random stuff. It's what looks like tapioca in goo. And, um, yeah, I have no idea what to do with it, but it's fun to squish. Luigi! Better than Mario any day. Kissing fish. Another random shop. It's kind of cool, I like it. J! Okay. Maybe I'll put my initials up there or something. Yoma! More graffiti art. Oh, 
Oh, that's fucking scary. Mr. Toppers. I got my hair cut there. Red Veg. I think that's a retro shop. Yeah, Mr. Toppers is just seven quid. It's nice. Cornish pastry. Yes, probably, that's probably good. I'm not sure if I've ever been there. Jump the gun. That's great. That's like really retro. That's like vintage stuff. And the shoes and everything. Wish I had money to shop there. Yeah. That's kind of creepy. Oh, punctured. I got pierced there, but I've never seen the, the gate before because I've come when it's open rather than closed. Another random one. Gak. Yeah, that's the, the guitar and amp shop. You know, Brighton's really big for, like, um, underground tattoo parlours and piercing places and things. Like, it does an absolute ton of them. There's this really shady-looking shack near where I live that does tattoos. I've never gone anywhere near it. I won't get a tattoo till later on, anyway. Yeah, there's two sets of lanes. The south and the north. Yeah, you know, I'm I'm in I'm in the north. I did barely ever go to the south. Doesn't just in magazines. We are British, hooray! Bagpuss, all sorts of stuff. Pussy Co. Or something like that. What is it? Pussy? I don't know. Anyway, the most random shop ever. I don't know. It just does like all kinds of silly knickknacks, like. Why would you want that? Like, I just don't get it. But I have a friend who's like obsessed with that shop. Brighton Coffee Co. Simple name. Does the job. Pee Wee's hair. Antique bric a brac. Now that is a cool store. There's just like a ton of like secondhand art and clothes and they've got like SNES games and things. It's just it smells really musty and dusty but you can find some whacked out things. Huh. I was half expecting to see Lady Gaga. Skating shop. Fucking great. Actually it does all sorts of toys, but for the most part skates Skateboards. Oh, those kind of flexible bodyboards that I don't really like. Rainbow! Days Comics. I believe this is where I got, uh, well, you can find manga in there. So I got my Death Note and stuff. I could get, I could buy Death Note in there and other stuff. There's this one called Absolute Boyfriend. I have no idea if that's a hideous mistranslation or whether it's actually called that and they don't care. But um, I just think it's really weird. <laughs> Wow. Sissy Mo. Bet she is. Like your mother. But yeah, this is this is weird and random again. It's like aliens or something, I don't know. I don't know. This is all just so really different. Carpet doll. It's probably exactly that. Beads on it. What looks like Stevie Wonder gone mad. Cyberdog has to be my absolute favourite clothes shop in the world. I don't think I would ever dress my kids up like that. Well, I really want to go in the store, but you can't really go in the store with a camera. You see what he's got? Like some headset thing. Awesome. I think that's just no burgers. I think it means no food. I would kill you when I would eat you. I think it's amazing. You could have a rave in there, no problem. My that is my favourite food shop. You can get this random stuff. It's what looks like tapioca in goo. And um yeah, I have no idea what to do with it, but it's fun to squish. Guns! Right. 